Thank you for visiting the YouTube channel. Ebra 2 Ment AMX We present the biomagnetic pair of the syndrome Guillain Barr. The poles of this biomagnetic pair are pineal, medulla oblongata. Always check the presence and polarity of both poles to confirm the condition and administer the magnetic energy correctly. The energetic muscular response is checked in the patient's feet where the right leg is shortened, placed negative, where the leg extends, is placed positive. It is always the right leg that responds. The biomagnetic inductor only requires two minutes to eliminate any biomagnetic pair. If you are using magnets, in the description, you will find a formula to calculate the time needed by the magnets to eliminate the biomagnetic pair according to the geographic location where the therapy is performed. We located the biomagnetic pole for pineal in the crown or upper part of the head and the biomagnetic pole for medulla oblongata in the nape. Symptoms of the condition begin in the lower extremities and both sides of the body usually with a tingling, followed by numbness, stiffness, muscle weakness, and finally paralysis. Symptoms go up the body, may present facial paralysis in severe cases, and even difficulty breathing. The disease Guillain-Barr is considered by the medical science like a syndrome of the type autoimmune and etiology or unknown cause. Biomagnetism recognizes it as a disease, infectious, and a viral origin. The Guillain-Barre damages the central nervous system, due to an important and serious demyelination. The speed with which it advances is very variable. The symptomatology can be presented in several days or quickly in only hours. The disease may last for a few days and disappear completely, or may last for months with significant sequelae. Fast forward cases are infrequent, but usually the outcome is fatal, causing respiratory paralysis in a few days, sometimes less than a week. In Abra 2 Ment AMX, we have identified the proliferation of the virus causing the disease Guillain Barr by mosquito bite and probably sexual contact, we believe, in a manipulation or creation of the virus in laboratory requires association with a bacteria to begin to act, we assume, at least two bacteria able to activate the virus, we have not managed to identify. Depends on the quality of the muca protein that gives, one or another bacterium, the aggressiveness of the disease. Recent publications, from medical research, relate the Zika virus to the Guillain-Barr syndrome, confirming our assumption of the mosquito as a biological vector or form of contagion. Subscribe to receive the new videos of the channel. Click on I like for see more videos like this. Invite your family and friends. Ebra 2 Ment AMX thanks you for watching the video. And until the next, always remember, thought is the only thing that makes works your energy. Care what you think.